Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is episode 28 of the FIFA 18 My Player Career. And as you know, we are with Palermo. We're in our third season here with the Italian side. We've just been promoted to the Calcio A or the Serie A League. And we're not doing too great. Six games in. We've only lost one, but we've only won one as well. Drawing four, only scoring four, and only conceding four. So seven points currently. We'll take on Torino next. And they, as you can see, top of the table. Second place actually, just behind Lazio. So it is going to be a tough game here for Palermo, but we are the home side. We need to start winning some games, otherwise we can see ourselves falling into some kind of um, relegation battle, which is not where we want to be, of course. Um, Palermo didn't improve their squad in the summer, unfortunately. They brought in a couple of um, loanees, but I don't know how good they are actually going to um, be, whether they're going to help us at all. Um, we are struggling, as you know, going, create, going forward, being creative. Um, so we really need to try and improve that. Try and get Kai on uh, in the action more going forward instead of him dropping so far deep, which just lets us um, be a little bit weaker going forward. And here is Kai playing it out wide onto that far side, looking to get across him. What was that terrible pass there by our teammate on that left side? And six minutes in, we do have ourselves a throw in. Throwing it gets passed and then crossed in. Get the words out. And it was a poor cross in the end. So onwards we go then. Approaching the 20-minute mark. And it is still goalless. Torino this, Torino this time pushing forward with the attacking moves. There is a bit of space there opening up for them. And he's onside. Was he onside though? He must have been off onside. And it would have counted if that one had gone into the back of the net. But thankfully it didn't. But Torino still looking dangerous. On the edge of the area. Look, trying to find some space. Space comes in. The shot of the, was off target. Uh, thankfully, the score remains 0-0. Kai having a quiet first 20 minutes of the game, currently sitting on a 6.5 rating. The ball gets played out there, and we are jumping into the second half. Still waiting for the first goal of the game. Kai has improved in the early stages of this second half. As you can see, he's currently sitting on a 7.2 rating. But a nice little interception there by Torino, and it's now them. Who are on the attack. We need to try and defend. Try and stay focused. We don't want to lose in this one late on. Cross comes in near post. And there is the opening goal of the game. Torino. They are the ones with it. It was coming to be fair. We've not really had much action ourselves going forward. And Torino have had a couple of chances. And this time they do make us pay for it. A nice little finish there. Inside the, the inside near post. And the goalkeeper should have done better. Defence should have been better positioned. But what can you do? When we're only controlling one player. So we're heading into the final five minutes. Then, and we are still trailing by one goal to nil. Um, so it's going to be a tough loss this one. Especially being the home side. And Trino though have had a good start to this season. So you can't really blame them um, for that. And they just want to go out and stay top as much as they can. Kai just win it back though. And a chance here to level it up. Why did he pass that? He was in so much space going forward. He tried to lay it off. And there was already two players around him. Look at this. Look at all that space. And he decides to lay it off. Why would he do that? The AI are just destroying our chances here. Um, Kai's obviously having to drop deep just to get any creativity going forward. And then when he is forward, um, his teammates don't make the runs or they pass it to different players. Or when Kai's already surrounded by players himself. So the AI really need to improve. Our teammates need to get better. We do have a little bit of a break now though. It is the Europa League. Third game of the group stages. And hopefully we can get a victory here against Sturm Graz. Now, I'm not entirely sure who will be the favourites for this one. Both teams um, not the favourites to go through. So it is the weaker game here for Palermo. But hopefully we can go out and get the victory. We've had a, a couple of decent results so far. And we've got a draw against Borussia Dortmund, I believe. I cannot even remember. It's been a couple of days since I last um, uploaded. Uh, but let's see how we get on then. Hopefully, as I said, we can get the three points here in Europe. The league's just not happening for us right now. We need a few games, I think, to warm up in the big league. And let's see how we can get this one started. Grab that early goal. Hopefully, that will get us pushed forward. And we're full of confidence. The player just been taken down there. Kai chasing back deeper, though. And nicely played here. Needs support. Support was there, couldn't get the cross in though, and good little deflection there. Goes straight into the hands of the Sturm Graz goalkeeper. So Palermo nil, Sturm Graz nil. Ten minutes to play in this first half, and it is the Italian side with possession. Kai just laying it off there, bit of space open up on that far side, but we're playing more centrally. 
Kai again laying it off, waiting for the through ball. Can he get it back? He doesn't. What the hell is going on? Again, the AI and the teammates just letting us down with their final passes. The space opens up. Kai runs into it. Oh, good shot there, but a good save as well. Goalkeeper got down low at that far post, makes a save, and he does go out of play for a corner. Let's have a look. Yeah, cracking save there from the goalkeeper. It would have been 1 0 if he had not got there. So it is going to be a corner, as I said, to Palermo. Kai currently on a, a 7 rating. And that one needs to be nodded down. Ah, Sturmgratz get there first. They clear it into the um, half of Palermo. We're jumping into the second half. Still no goals. Lacking creativity. Kai trying to force his way through two defenders there. But he couldn't manage to do it. And now Sturmgratz there on the attack. He's played through. He's onside as well, I believe. Shot comes in, goalkeeper makes a save, but the defender takes him down as he took the shot. And it is going to be a penalty to the away side. And no book in there, probably should have at least got a yellow card if that was actually um, a foul. Let's see the replay. Here is a replay. Takes off the shot and just goes in through him um, with the follow-up. So yeah, penalty deserved. Hopefully the goalkeeper can save our day here, keeping it nil-nil. Shot comes in and it goes into the bottom corner. Goalkeeper dives the wrong way. It is the away side. Sturmgratz who go in front. One goal to nil. And we don't have much time now to try and get ourselves an equalising goal. Otherwise we could see ourselves heading towards an exit of the Europa League. Which is not what we wanted of course. We want to try and make a run of it in the Europa League. It doesn't look like we're going to be finishing towards the top of the table. So the only way we can get into the Champions League next season was to win this competition it already looks like we might be heading out early yeah, but there is a yellow card there a chance here for Palermo just over an hour gone to try and get themselves back on level terms and headed away there by Stern Gratz and now possible counter attackers on here for the away side play straight through the middle nice little interception though by Palermo Kai, is he going to ask for it? He does down the line. He needs support in the area. Cuts inside, plays it in the middle and just inside, uh, just outside, sorry, the six-yard box. The, the, the Palermo attacker was running straight through. Kai with the assist and Palermo level things up. Is that Adam Armstrong? I don't know if that's the, one of the new lone E players that we've just brought in. Uh, but it was a nice little run there. Somehow Kai saw him as he cut inside. Look at that. Beautiful little ball and a nice finish. Goalkeeper probably should have done better like we should have done. Oh, it's Lagamina. He was the one that gets his first European goal of his career and of the season. And with less than 15 minutes to go, all we need to do now is try and hold on. But we have give away a stupid corner kick there. Kai up to an 8.5 after getting that um, late assist. Just over 10 minutes to play. Concentrate, boys. Come on, don't give away any more penalties. Shot comes in straight into the hands of the goalkeeper. And now uh, can we go on an attack ourselves and try and steal the late three points? We don't win that header. And already Sterngratz are on the attack again. And that one flies into the top corner, the back of the net. Goalkeeper didn't stand a chance with that one. Fantastic finish there from Sterngratz. And they are back in front, two goals to one. Less than 10 minutes to play and now we've got some more work to do. Have we got enough time? Well, we've got enough time. Have we got enough uh, talent in the squad to go forward and get the second goal for us? And good little finish there. Defence should have closed him down faster, but they failed to do so. Friday Easy, he, that's his name. What a name that was. Never heard of him before. Yeah, but Plermo, we have less than a minute to play. Over on the attack, looking for a late equaliser. Can we find it? Ball over the top, tries to go towards Kai. But just a little bit too much on it goes over everybody and the goalkeeper clears it uh, is that time up it is indeed so there blows the final whistle Palermo another loss for them losing two goals to one at home against Sterngratz not the vic not the result that we wanted of course Kai he finishes the game with an 8.4 final match rating did get an assist but wasn't able to get himself a goal and now to end today's episode is a big one it is Palermo away taking on Juventus. Now Juve have got to be the big favourites for this game of course. The Italian Giants and probably um, reigning champions. I didn't see actually who won the league last season. But I'm sure it would have been Juventus. Or at least they would have been very very close if they weren't the title winners. Now let's see how we get on though. We have already beat a couple of the big names this season. We beat Napoli remember in the Italian Supercourt. 
We beat them last season as well and we also beat Roma and Udinese. So let's try and add another big team to the scout and try and get a victory. Passing nicely here you have to say until that last little touch there. And now Juventus are on the attack on this near side. He is being chased down though. Still going forward here Bernadeschi. Can he get the crossing? He pulls it back, lays it off, tries to lay it off, but good play there from Palermo. We have possession back, and look at this, even teasing him there at the back as well. Uh, player to watch, Paolo Dybala. And no, no doubt he is going to be a danger going forward. Not scored yet, though. 15 minutes in, just over 15 minutes in. And there is a shot, crack and save there by the Palermo um, goalkeeper. Uh, kind of needs to get into this game a bit more. He's only on a 6.4 rating. And that one was going into that bottom corner, as you see from the replay there. So it is a corner kick then to Juventus. Corner gets swung in near post. Need to get this one clear. And there, uh, it's nice and clear towards Kai. Can Kai win the ball though? He tries to nod it on. And Juve then back in possession with the goalkeeper, who kicks it onto this near side. And it is Juve on the attack yet again. You have to say they are looking the most dangerous going forward. Uh, he's got no support with him right now. He has to come back, playing it more centrally. Back out onto the wing, no. And that's a nice ball. Does the defender shot, comes in, hits the woodwork, bounces clear. The goalkeeper actually made a save for that. Um, so it is going to be a corner kick to Juventus. And get the ball clear, please. Kai needs to make the run. Uh, it's opening up a little bit. He tries to play the ball over the top for some reason. Kai nods it back down. Plumo still had the possession. Didn't quite work out, so we're going to head into the second half then. Less than 20 minutes remaining. Still waiting for the first goal of the game. Plumo are holding on here. We need to improve, though. Um, even if we do go on and lose this game, or even if we win this game, there's a lot of work to do here in Palermo, um, especially if we want to finish in a decent position this season. Kai goes straight through the Juventus player there. He's surely going to get a book in. It is indeed. It's going to be his first booking of the season. As you can see, the frustration is taking its toll on Kai. He needs to calm down a bit. Maybe he needs a bit of a rest. Maybe we should ask to have a rest. Maybe sim a game or two. Um, we'll have to wait and see. See what kind of re uh, fixtures are coming up for Kai. But things really do need to improve. Maybe we can steal this one late on though. We've got just over 10 minutes remaining. Still Juventus nil, Palermo nil. It is Palermo on the attack. And the spaces open up. Cross comes in far post. The defender had to get there. And he does head it behind for a Palermo corner. So Palermo then with the corner. Kai is coming to the near post. Comes towards him. Defender got there first though. And that one's laid off. Shot comes in. Nicely blocked there by the Juve defender. Goalkeeper. He punches it away. Kai asks for it on the edge of the area. Well, I say on the edge of the area. About 30 yards out. And Juve are going to get this one clear. Or are they? We've stolen it. And a chance here for... Palermo, the goalkeeper, makes a save. The rebound was there. It hit the crossbar. Bounces clear. And that was the chance there for Palermo. I thought for a second we was going to be in front. Um, but the goalkeeper made the original block. The block went to our striking partner who could only hit the woodwork. And it was an empty goal as well. So should have done better. Should have won this one. Juve going forward. Straight into the hands of the goalkeeper. And it looks like this one is also going to be ending goalless. And another draw in the league for Palermo. And as I said, we really do need to improve. Otherwise, we are going to be fighting for survival. Yeah.